everyone, my name is Python GB, and today I'm going to be bringing you something a little different. Yes, this is indeed a gaming channel, but every now and then, I would like to do something like this to keep you informed of what's going on around the web. In this video, what I'm going to be doing is showing you the new YouTube dashboard. This is a feature that was introduced very recently. So, to access the new YouTube dashboard, what you do, obviously, you need to go onto your channel, so in my case, Python GB. Let's pause the autoplay video because we don't need that. <laughs> anyway, so what you do, you can go to uh, Video Manager. So you got the button there, or of course you got under the menu right there. And the new dashboard is at the top of the side menu here. It actually says new, so obviously it's easier to see. Obviously a proper link under this menu or somewhere else wouldn't go amiss. In fact, that would be pretty useful. Obviously it's still early days, but... It's not all good. So, this is the new YouTube dashboard. As you can see, along the top, you have a, a general sort of summary of your channel. Uh, for example, you've got the amount of subscribers, the amount of uh, video views you've had in total, and how many months you've been with your channel. Or how long you've had your channel. Yeah, that's what I mean. <laughs> so, obviously, at the top here, uh, if you can monetize your videos, it will say so. Obviously, you can get rid of that. But this is the main YouTube dashboard. As you can see here, you get a summary of your most recent videos that you have uploaded to your channel. And obviously you can view all of them by clicking on this little link down here. Uh, at the side here, you've got a little summary of uh, sort of analytics stuff. Uh, like how many video views you've had in the last 30 days. Uh, how many subscribers you've uh, won and lost or net change you've had in the last 30 days. Uh, down here, you've got what's new. Uh, obviously there's not much going on at the minute. Uh, you can... Uh, change when videos start and finish basically in your place. I mean, that's pretty awesome. I mean, I'm pretty sure I won't use that, but the most, the best thing that I think is being introduced is this. Writing the same video info over and over again. Yes, I am. Save time by setting defaults in your account settings. That is actually a very good system to have. And obviously the final part of the YouTube dashboard, I don't know if it's going to be expanding in the future, hopefully it will, because, you know, that'll be pretty awesome. Uh, down here you have the recent comments you've had on your videos. Now, in an attempt to keep my inbox completely, sort of, spammy free, what I've done, I normally delete uh, comment uh, messages as they come in, basically. So yeah, obviously, I don't know, from now on I probably won't, because obviously I'll be able to see what's going on right here. Who knows, in future, maybe the dashboard will be your new default, sort of, I don't know, default page that you go to instead of your home page. Or maybe you could have an option to do that. Oh, wouldn't that be awesome? So yeah, thank you very much for watching, I do hope you enjoyed it. Don't forget to check out my gameplay videos, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you did find it useful or informative. And of course, subscribe if you want to be the first to know when my new videos go out on my channel. Thanks again, and I shall see you guys later.